Hey guys, what's up? By Sectatron here, bringing you guys today's video. This is a very exciting video because we finally have the world championship of Clash of Clans coming. It's a thing. There is going to be a top clan at some point and there is a million dollars on the line. A lot of information came out relatively recently. There's gonna be links in the description that you guys can see all the details. But the purpose of this video is to kind of talk to you guys uh, recap what we know about the Clash of Clans World Championship, which is run now by ESL. It's the eSports League, a third party that's involved in the competitive play for all different types of games beyond just Clash of Clans. So Clash of Clans is becoming an eSport um, is one way to look at it. Um, so we're going to be talking about all of that. And also, stick around to the end of the video. I'm going to be telling you guys how you can potentially join me and some clan mates in trying to go far to the world championship in Clash of Clans because I'm organizing my own clan for this event. So if you're a Town Hall 12, keep your ears perked up to the end of this video. There's going to be some information uh, that you may be interested in. Okay, so how does this all work? Like I said, it'll be linked below, but let me just try to explain it in a few minutes the best I can. Basically, there's a few stages. There's pre-qualifiers, qualifiers, and the championship. The pre-qualifiers is in-game, um, and it is remote. You, nothing's in person. It is also open to everyone, and there's two different ways you can uh, participate in the pre-qualifiers. First, if you are participating in the built-in clan war leagues in Clash of Clans, this is a feature that came uh, in the fall, I believe, the monthly uh, clan war league. If you're participating in that and you're in the top league, if you're one of the top, I believe it's top four clans, uh, you will uh, win the pre-qualifiers and advance onto the qualifiers. So that's one way. If you're a top clan and champions won, um, you guys may have seen your inbox Supercell promoting uh, the top clans for the last few months. Now the top four from that, if they're able to go, will go to the qualifier, which I'll talk about in a minute. The other way to get past the pre-qualifier and advance into the qualifier is kind of a tournament style. It's called the ESL pre-qualifier. The way it works basically is you get a clan of five Town Hall 12s. You can have more, but there's going to be 5v5 wars. And basically... It's a, it's a tournament. Single elimination, up to 2,048 clans because it, it's a power of two, so it goes down nicely to four. Um, there's going to be a tournament bracket, single elimination. The wars are 15-minute prep, one-hour battle day, and times are set, which makes it a little bit difficult for people because um, depending on what you do you know, during the afternoon or whatever time it is for you, you may have to kind of scramble to actually participate in this. But um, that's how it works. It's a single elimination tournament, so you don't have to be in a top clan. You just need five Town Hall 12s who are able to do this. Um, each, each month is a pre-qualifier. So each month there is the ESL tournament, the 5v5 tournament I just talked about, plus there's the already existing in-game clan war leagues. The top four from each advances on to the in-person qualifier, which is actually held in Poland. So if you're thinking that you want to try to get past that pre-qualifier in advance to the qualifier, there's some additional requirements, being 18 plus, able to travel, stuff like that, which obviously takes out more people, unfortunately, because um, you have to be both a Town Hall 12, a skilled Town Hall 12, and a tw Town Hall 12 who's able to travel. So there are a lot of requirements, I guess. Um, but that is basically how it works. Then there's each month after the pre-qualifier, the qualifier takes place in person in Poland, five clan members from each of the eight clans, four from ESL, four from in-game league, uh, participate. And then the top clan from that is advancing on to the world championship. So the way it works is this, there's going to be six months of this, I believe. So each month, there'll be one clan that advances from the qualifier to the championship, plus two wild cards. Um, it's unclear how it's going to be chosen, but it's chosen um, partly by Supercell employees and partly by the uh, community who votes a clan in. 
Um, so that'll get the two wild card spots filled. And then it'll once again have eight clans, not for a qualifier this time, but now for the actual world championship. So very exciting stuff. That'll be a huge event. Um, it'll also be in Poland, I believe. Uh, Katowice, I'm, I know I'm saying the name of it wrong. I just, I, I haven't heard of this city before and I just looked at, looked it up the name on Google Images. I don't actually know the pronunciation, so um, you'll have to excuse me on that But for not being cultured. Um, but it's a city in Poland, and um, that's where the qualifiers and the uh, actual world championship are held. The world championship with a live audience, huge eSport event. If you guys have watched other games and eSports, you know how big these things are. Um, so that's very exciting. Now, I mentioned before, if you're a Town Hall 12, there are there is an opportunity to join me and some clan mates in my own organized clan. So the way it works is, and I'll link my Discord in the description, you can join that even if you're just interested, you're not sure if you're able to do it or not. It's just for people that are interested right now. So be sure to uh, click the link if you are you know, a Town Hall 12 who has some interest. Basically, I'm trying to field myself and four other Town Hall 12s possibly with a few extras to give some flexibility for subs because not everyone can do each war um, for the ESL option. But um, I'm taking the top Town Hall 12s I can find and we're going to try to get past the pre-qualifiers and advance on to the qualifiers, which is a, a difficult thing to do if you're starting out with about 2,000 clans. You have to win eight to nine matches um, in a row to advance but this is you know it's free to enter and it's definitely worth doing it's worth organizing now the timing i didn't talk about this too much in detail and i'm not going to in this video because you can look on the esl website um, which is linked below for the exact info on when the times of the uh, esl pre-qualifier take place basically it's every month kind of mid middle of the month um three days a few hours each day, uh, making up a few diff a few wars. So there's going to be 11 wars in total, um, which narrows it down to like one clan, but the top four will qualify. So the long story short, it's going to require players to have availability. Um, if you're in the States, like I am, during kind of the middle of the day, which is difficult for a lot of people with like real life jobs and stuff going on, obviously. So that prevent uh, presents a bit of a hurdle. But um, that's the reality of it. So ESL option, if you guys are interested, if you're a Town Hall 12, not going to make any guarantees. It's going to be run super competitively. So um, there's no guarantees if you know me, if you're a patron on Patreon. Um, that's not related to this at all. It's just finding the best players we can. And the clan is being run by myself. So things are still being planned out, but that's how it's looking if you, once again, Town Hall 12 interested, click the link Click the link in the description and you can find out some more on the server right now, just doing the preliminary stuff. But anyway, guys, for everyone else, that will pr pretty much sum up this video. Hope you enjoyed. Hope I made it clear enough. Like I said, the links in the description might be more helpful if you want some very specific information on how it works. But that's, that's it, guys. Pre-qualifier, which is remote in-person qualifier, then in-person live audience, huge event. This won't be for a while because there's going to be six months worth of qualifiers, one each month. But eventually, um, there will be that live uh, championship, which is going to be a blast to watch. Um, so I look forward to that. And hopefully, I won't be watching. Maybe I'll be playing in it. Um, but, but anyway, thanks for watching this video, and I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you next time. Got some good content coming out very soon, so stay tuned for that. Until then, Bisectatron out.